for early morning magic that's the start of our four-part challenge day and um, yeah it's, we're really looking forward to it we're already starting off a little bit tired but we're just <laughs> gonna get coffee and yeah. it's gonna be fine um, so yeah so we're starting at Hollywood Studios then we are going to go to Epcot and um, followed by Animal Kingdom that's where we have our fast passes our three fast passes for the day and then we are going to finish off the day in Magic Kingdom. Yeah. So we were so excited. We've never tried this before. No. Um, so yeah, let's start the day. It's Buzz. Yeah, we'll come back and see Buzz. Bye. Bye. People are getting their photographs before they get Slinky Dog hair. Yeah. <laughs> Alright friends, come on in, put yourself all the way over to the right hand side. Would you mind holding this while it's recording? Absolutely. Thank you. Oh, nice. We're doing the today. <gasps> I'm exhausted thinking about that. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Awesome. Bye, Jesse. I think the other day you've got something better. 
Let's see, you had a really good game. Yeah, 166,000 something. Yeah, you so, definitely yeah, deserve to win. Best ever game, so I'm really happy. <laughs> Is he talking about you guys? <laughs> Hi. Hi boss! Nice to see you! You're hanging out in Andy's backyard. Yeah. Reach for this! <laughs> but not when you're riding Slinky Dog. You need to keep your hands, arms, feet, and legs inside Slinky on that one. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's gonna be a good day. Oh, thank you. <laughs> Such a gem, thank you. Yeah. Do you mind holding my camera? Sure. It's recording. Just, just recording? Yeah. Okay, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yep. They're in the UK. Yeah. And I bet you you're probably done the one of Paris already, haven't you? Yes, we have. Oh, it was closed when I went. Yeah. Uh, I heard good things. You too. <laughs> You're there, I know. You're everywhere, bud. We can't leave you out. He just flies a hyperdrive. Too awesome, yeah. And there's no one to drive up there. That's Rex. How's it going, Rex? Did I ever tell you I'm afraid of heights? No? Oh, you're gonna film. Cowboy hero of all time. <laughs> At least according to Jess. <laughs> Thank you, Buzz. <laughs> transport but I'm um, using lift and uh, we've been in Toy Story Land all morning so uh, we've done meet and greets with um, Woody and Bo Peep, uh, Jesse and Buzz 
and we raised Slinky Dog, Toy Story Mania and Alien Swirling Saucers. Yeah, and we yeah. didn't have so much a snack as a full breakfast, which full was breakfast. included in our early morning magic this yeah. morning. So <laughs> we're so full already, we just hope we can fit more snacks in. <laughs> so it's on to the next part now. Um, so hopefully we're going to get the friendship boat and it will take us to Epcot. So today's uh, four part challenge um, is our second to last day in the parks, isn't yeah. it? So we're actually saying goodbye to Hollywood Studios now, till next year, hopefully. Um, and we thought what we'd do is think about what our favorite from each park has been this trip. Because even though you have like all the things that you like to do and what you would call your favorites, it can like change. Yeah, kind of your top one can definitely change from year to year. Um, and uh, yeah, we normally do this at the end of every day, just think about what your favourite thing of the day's been. And uh, so we thought we'd do our favourite thing from each part from this trip. So, you want to go first? The Hollywood Studios is definitely still fantastic. Like, it's, ever since I first saw that show, it's been my favourite. And yeah, it was just amazing. And it was even more special this time because um, we had a really good crowd around us, didn't we? Yeah, the atmosphere was amazing. Yeah. yeah I, I would choose that as my favourite as well, Fantasmic. Um, it, it's kind of, maybe, you know, it, Hollywood Studios is growing and there's still not lots for us to do because we kind of don't do the um, two big rides. Um, and obviously Toy Story Land, unless you do the early morning magic, uh, it can be difficult to get around everything in a short space of time. But um, yeah, I just think Fantasmic is amazing. Yeah, yeah. So definite must do. Um, I think that's still our favourite thing from uh, Hollywood Studios. Um, so we've just got off the friendship boat and we just wanted to do a little shout out to the lovely Naomi who came for a little chat just before she got off. Um, it was really really lovely to meet you Naomi and really hope you see this video and um, and send us that photo you took as well because yeah. we'd really love to see it and definitely keep in touch. So cute. Yeah so she's so sweet. Over. Yeah. <laughs> Love that view. So we are at our second park of the day. Yeah. We are at Epcot. We just got the friendship boat and um, yeah, we just had a little wander up from the International Gateway through um, the UK Pavilion and the Canada Pavilion. And um, we are gonna we're gonna go and see what the wait time's like for Frozen Ever After because we haven't actually done it this trip and it's one of our all-time favorites. Yeah. Um, but if it's really long, then we're gonna to have to have a little chat about it because obviously we're trying to cram in as much as possible today. Yeah. Um, but we are gonna try and find some more rides and some more snacks, hopefully another meet and greet. Yeah, we actually really wanna see Wreck-It Ralph today because um, we missed him on our last trip, didn't yeah. we? We we got to see Vanellope, but we we were literally the the people in front of us were the last people who got to see them both together. Um, so that would be really great, but the wait times have been quite long for um, Ralph. But we'll see. We'll try. Yeah, we'll give it a go. <laughs> Yes, 
comfortable. Happy summer snow day from me to you. That's cool. We weren't, thought we weren't going to get on it, but then yeah. sort of we didn't realise how disappointed we were going to be. So um, we're really happy that we caught yeah, it. Definitely, um, it's such a nice pavilion, the um, Norway Pavilion. It's got so much going on. Yeah. Um, it really is a hotspot of Epcot. They've got Arno and Elsa, which you can't get anywhere else. They've got Princess Dining, and they've got like one of the best rides um, and the most popular as well. So yeah, it's all going on in Norway, isn't it? our way around the world showcase and we have just got our snack for Epcot from our favourite bakery which is the Murder's Original Bakery um, and we managed to find our favourite which we didn't find the other day we yeah. thought they'd stop doing it I think they just sold out um, but we managed to get one Yay. so it is the um, 
pecan, the caramel pecan bar. And we absolutely love it. And we've got loads of napkins as well, because we're gonna need them. <laughs> So we just um, came across the character Palooza, but we were a little bit too late. The, the, all the characters were going, kind of going in and finishing up, but um, we've never seen that before at Epcot, so. Uh, yeah, that was really nice. They do um, a lot of character blues and stuff at Disneyland Paris, don't they? Yeah. So um, it's nice to kind of see it um, happening here because we've never come across it before. Um, but yeah, Epcot is so quiet today. Lovely. We've been twice at the weekend on this trip, which by the way, don't do. Don't do that. We always <laughs> say don't come on a weekend if you want it to be less busy. Especially the last couple of weekends of the Flower and Garden Festival, exactly. which is what we did. Yeah, um, but it's lovely and quiet today, um, and it just feels less hot when there's less crowds, so uh, yeah. What do you want to get? so we weren't sure how long the line was going to take. Um, it did look quite big, didn't it? Yeah, but it was only about 35 minutes, I think, so not too bad for like new characters. Yeah. I remember once when Joy and Sadness first came to Epcot and we waited a long, long time, yeah. so yeah. 
that's 35 minutes isn't too bad. So we have ridden our ride, frozen ever after. Yep. We have eaten our snack, which was an amazing pecan bar from the Weather's Original Bakery in Germany Pavilion. And we have met Penelope and Rick and Ralph. We got our photo too with Spaceship Earth. Yeah. So it's um, time. We walked all the way around World we Showcase. We did. And we've we been to Future World. Yeah. <laughs> but, um, but yeah, we had a lovely time around the World yeah. Showcase and it was lovely and quiet. And yeah. Yeah. Really nice. So we've enjoyed our time at Epcot. It's time to say um, goodbye to Epcot now. It is time to say goodbye to Epcot. Oh, for this trip. Really nice time, haven't we? Yeah, we have. Favourite for this trip from Epcot? Oh, it's a tough one. Yeah. Um, probably that meet and greet with, yeah, with Ralph. I really enjoyed Penelope. that as well. Yeah. I think I think it's probably mine too. Yeah, and yeah. it was really <laughs> nice um, the other night that we got to see Illuminations, probably for the last, last time, time like that. Yeah. Um, but we're excited for the new whatever the new night yeah. and spectacular is going to be. Um, we are going to head off now. We're going to catch our next mode of transportation, which is going to be a mini van. Yeah. So um, we will see you at Animal Kingdom. Good, thank you. It's a little mini van. Oh, mini van driver is really nice. Yeah. I've been to Disneyland Paris. You can't get on the car tram. We haven't got a car. No. But we've seen it. We've I seen it. Counts, yeah. <laughs>
so we are in Animal Kingdom. Yeah. Uh, we've come down to Pandora um, because we had to get our snacks. And yeah. There was only really one lot of snacks that we could get from Animal Kingdom. They're our absolute favourite. Hongi Lumpia and a Night Blossom. Can't go wrong. <laughs> so, um, yeah, we just, and um, we've got a ton of quick service um, credits left, but yeah. we're pretty much out of snack credits. So um, we basically got three snacks for one quick service credit, yeah. So which is really good. So um, so yeah, we're going to enjoy these, and then we've got a fast pass for flight of passage. It's going to be our fifth um, flight of passage fast pass for this trip. Yeah. <laughs> um, but we absolutely love it, so we yeah. had to do it. And we've got a couple of more fast passes here as well. We decided to put all our fast passes here, so um, yeah, I'm excited. to the Avatar program. other when it finishes it's either people like go crazy of how amazing it was and people can't stop talking about it like straight away or complete silence like well everyone takes it all in um so yeah we absolutely love it yeah. we um we have got a fast pass next for expedition everest yeah um which we're really excited about it because we've only done it once this trip and we usually try and get it on like extra like extra magic hours or yeah. something like that just because queue can get quite long um but we haven't made it for extra magic hours yet have we? <laughs> no. we haven't done a very good job no <laughs> so um we are gonna head over to asia and um we'll take you with us Sure. 
close together going on a lot of adventures. <laughs> What's that? It's a squirrel. Squirrel. Ah, good boy. He's always a good boy. Okay, everybody. You want to take it? Wonderful. Beautiful. There you go. You're welcome. to get um, three rides, uh, Flight of Passage, Expedition Everest and Primeval Will as well. Uh, we managed to get round all the different parts, so Africa, Asia, Pandora and Dino Land and Discovery Island as yeah. well. Um, we met Doug and Russell. Aww, oh, they were really cute. They were really, they were really, really cute. Yeah. Uh, the last time we saw them was actually on our birthday. Um, but yeah, uh, Kevin stopped in as well, yeah. so she came to say hello to them and we've kind of seen her all, like roaming around and stuff. Um, we've seen lots of bands and different dance parties and things going on, so yeah, a, lot, a lot's been happening here at Animal Kingdom this afternoon. Yeah. Um, but we are going to have to move on. Yes, and but we are going to have to say goodbye. We are going to say goodbye. We, we need to pick our favourites though. Yep. 
from Animal Kingdom. Uh, I think I know what yours is, and I think mine's the same. <laughs> Festival, Festival Lion, Lion King. King. Yeah, it's amazing. It makes me cry every time. We've seen it twice on this trip and it just doesn't feel like it's enough. Um, and it's something that I miss when I'm not here as yeah. well. Um, and it just, yeah, it just brings me to tears every time. Yeah, and I just I love, love it. it and sit there the whole time with a big smile on my face. And yeah, so definitely Festival of Lion King is a must do for Animal Kingdom. So, we're very hot and it's time to leave we yeah. are going to finish off our four part challenge uh, with a little trip over to magic kingdom <laughs>
Disney's Carousel of Progress. Oh, you're in for a real treat. Yeah, it looks like the Robins are getting ready to celebrate Valentine's Day today. What year is it? Oh, right around the turn of the century. Believe me, things couldn't be any better than they are today. Closer to home, we've now got gas lamps, a telephone, and the latest design in cast iron stoves. And that reservoir keeps five gallons of water hot in just three buckets of coal. Oh, well, that sure beats chopping wood. There's a great big beautiful tomorrow shining at the end of every day. Boy, hottest Fourth of July we've had in years. We've come a long way, though, since the turn of the century, over 20-some-odd years ago. You know that pilot fella, Charles Lindbergh? He's about to fly a single-wing airplane all the way across the Atlantic. <laughs> He's never going to make it. There's a great, big, beautiful tomorrow, and tomorrow's just a dream away. Well, it's another Halloween here in the fabulous 40s. Everything is better than ever now. And we've got some amazing new wonders around the house to prove it. For instance, our refrigerator holds more food and ice cubes. And thanks to our automatic dishwasher, oh, I don't have to dry the dishes anymore after supper. It's all a great thing beautiful tomorrow. Shining at the end of every day. Isn't it a pleasant holiday? I don't know, turkey's in the oven, it's peaceful and quiet. Yes! 300 points, my best score yet. Well, it was feasible until Santa brought that new virtual reality space pilot game. Your turn, Grandma. There's a great big beautiful tomorrow. Just a dream away. Good evening. Good evening. Uh, we're here at the Magic Kingdom. It's our last part of our four part challenge. Yeah, we made it. Um, yeah, we had to stop by the hotel though to uh, get a shower. It was like 36 degrees. Yeah, um, yeah it was really, really hot. <laughs> so uh, we went back for a quick shower and uh, made it to Magic Kingdom uh, via um, lift and the monorail. Yeah, so yeah, we, we actually did the monorail and uh, happily ever after fireworks were going off while we were on there and as we entered the park, so which was really nice. And it kind of made us really carried away. We kept moving on to the next and the next yeah. and we haven't actually spoken to you yet. But we've been really busy. Um, first of all though, we did watch the rest of Happily Ever After, which was really nice, wasn't it? Yeah. And uh, then we went for some food at um, Pecosville, which was good, wasn't it? Yeah, really yeah. nice. Uh, and then we started hitting some rides. So <laughs> <laughs> just on the way by, we went for Adventureland and uh, went on Pirates of Caribbean. And then we scooted straight over to Tomorrowland. We had a fast, we just managed to pick up a, an extra fast pass uh, for Buzz Lightyear yeah, Space Ranger Spin. So uh, we did that one. And we've also been in the Carousel of Progress. Yeah. We've not been in for ages, have we? We've been in the one time um, on our first trip here and we've never been in since. So we went and had a little sit down in there and enjoyed the Carousel of Progress. Yeah. yeah. We've had our photograph on Main Street and um, we've just got one more thing left to do which is to meet a character um, and yeah we'll just see what happens after this. Uh, we're now um, in extra magic hours so we've got some time left so we'll just see if we can get an extra ride or if we're hungry we might even get a snack. <laughs> uh, we'll just see how much we can fit in but we're so glad to have got round all four parts aren't we? It's been yeah. really really fun. Uh, so we'll just see what happens in this last part.
want you to close your eyes and make a very big wish yeah. with a little faith, yeah. trust, and pixie dust to make all your dreams and wishes come true. There you go. All right. You ready? Yeah. We want you to close your eyes and make a very big wish yeah. with a little faith, yeah. trust, and pixie dust to make all your dreams and wishes come true. Keeping your hands, arms, feet, and legs inside the boat, and please watch your children. Take your picture outside gas funds. Yeah.
so that's our evening at Magic Kingdom over and that's our last part done of yeah. our four part challenge. Um, we've had a brilliant day haven't we? Yeah it has been so much fun. Thank you so much if you've stuck with us and uh, <laughs> seen everything we've been up to on the four part challenge. Um, it just feels a bit like a normal day on the, we normally do two parts a day but um, to do four is really nice especially considering that we kind of said goodbye to three out of the four parks today. We've got one more park day tomorrow which we're going to spend here in Magic Kingdom again. It is our favourite park and uh, we always spend our last night in the Magic Kingdom, don't we? Yeah, yeah. and it feels like the right time to talk about our favourites from Magic Kingdom. Yeah. Um, this is so hard. It's too hard to choose, really. If we really had to be forced into making a decision, it would have to be the fireworks. Yeah, happily ever, ever after. after. Um, we love it don't we yeah. and we love wishes and we love this one even more and just pretty much everything they do here at Magic Kingdom is magical yeah. and like that's why it's our favourite park so um, yeah we absolutely love it here don't we yeah we've and got one more thing to do yeah just to ride the bus back to Coronado Springs <laughs> if you have enjoyed this video please do give it a thumbs up and make sure you subscribe to our channel so you can catch all of our other videos yeah, and uh, if you're on Instagram, yeah. we're on Instagram as well and Facebook, so uh, if you aren't already following, please do uh, follow and uh, you can see all our pictures from this trip and more. Thanks for watching. Have a magical day.